Welcome. If you like this video, don't forget to like, share, and subscribe. It helps spread the word and helps make more of these videos possible. If you like this video even more, you can make a recurring donation via Patreon or a one-time donation via Coffee. The links are all in the description below. Enjoy the video. Hello, this is Gary again, and I have another video for you today. Today, I will be doing an unboxing of this package I got in the mail. So I got an email from this company called uh, Busy Bee Stationery, and I think they do um, monthly sort of stationery of the month club. And they sent me an email saying they wanted to send me one to see what I thought. So I said, sure, because I think you guys might like that. Um, so I figure let's just open this up and see what's in it. Uh, all I know is that it's stationery. Uh, let's see how it opens, okay gonna open this way see busy bee stationery and uh let's see what oh the packaging is pretty try to see if i can cut this with the sorry about this noise i'll see if i can fix that in post oh this is pretty okay wow this is a bunch of stuff um, and I'll have some information on how you can join their their club down in the description below. But um, these are some really cute paper clips um, that I think you can use well as paper clips. Um, but this is pretty good. You can use this as like page markers or whatever. And there's some look like metallic markers. Uh, we'll probably swatch those out. Let's see this. This is a cute little notepad. You can uh, put this to take notes. You always want stuff to take notes. This looks like a, uh, nope, this, I thought this was a Tombow, but it's not. It's uh, American Crafts Galaxy Marker, um, paint like ink. Oh, so this is like a opaque metallic ink. Oh, this looks, oh, scissors. I love scissors. Um, this looks to be some, uh, Ooh, some fancy tape. Um, this is pretty cool. Hold on. All right, I'm gonna unpack this in a minute because I definitely want to check this out. This is some scissors. Oh, these are some uh, scissors for making uh, fancy edges. Oh yeah, we definitely are gonna test this out. Um, let's see. This is their their note. Oh, teal coloring. So I guess every month they have a theme. So this is their. Uh, their month their theme for this month is uh coloring oh this is fun oh this is like a little journal type thing i could use this for sketching oh this is like a yeah i could definitely use this for um sketching or for doing patterns um and i think you can color the front up to make it uh more like uh more sort of yours um more personalized that's the word i'm looking for more personalized let's see what this is Take that out. Uh, put this in here. That's gonna go to the cats in his little cat area. They have a little cat area. And uh, all right, so that's it. That's everything in the package. And uh, this is, oh, I think this is a stencil. Stencils, oh, a stencil and a stamp. Ooh, I do wanna get into stamping. I have no idea where to start, but I wanna get into stamping that you can color. Um, so if you guys know how to get me started on that, um, or if you guys know anyone who would know, let me know down in the comments, cause I have no idea, but I have seen people do some really nice uh, coloring um, with stamps. So this will be my, my first, uh, my first stamp and I believe these are like uh, stencils that you can use with the stamp I think all right so um, let me pause and I will get some I'm actually going to use the paper that they included to do some of this swatching for some of these colors and uh, I'll be right back all right so I did a little bit of playing around and um, the scissors are super cute I did struggle a little bit to get them to cut um, to cut more than the length of the scissors i think i did okay having almost no experience with this cutting a little bit longer than the length of the scissors was a problem for me but uh maybe if you have more experience with these kinds of things it will be easier the box is i don't know if i said the box is uh just under $40 a month and you get things for you know lettering journaling that kind of thing and um 
yeah so okay so um these are i believe looks like they're about an inch and a half across and maybe double that um lengthwise and there's a little bit of sticky thing in the back so you can use these for all kinds of things um for you know large and small projects as you wish this is kind of big for me to use for um because mostly i work quite small but if you do you know if you want to do i don't know i don't know what kind of a project you'd want to do but if you want to do something where you want these big uh half circles on their scallops at the end you can totally do that and just remove the adhesive in the back and adhere them to um to your current project um, I decided not to use uh, one of the notebooks that they sent only because, um, I don't know, I just had this paper here that I wanted to try. Um, I do want to give you just really briefly a close-up of this uh, little paper clip. It's super cute. Um, I have seen people sort of DIY these kinds of things. And uh, let's see, and then, hold on. And then you could use it like that to sort of mark your page or to, you know, use these for gifts or what have you, or just for, you know, noting your planning pages. Um, this looks to be a sort of opaque, uh, possibly acrylic paint kind of thing. Let's open this up. Sorry about that. Let's open this up and see how it looks. Oh yeah, this is definitely, this reminds me a little bit of like the Posca paint kind of thing. Um, but a little bit, um, a little bit more marker like than the Posca. Let's see if you guys can see. Um, and it does dry pretty quickly. And I believe that these are uh, non-toxic as well, acid free. Oh no, no, it's not, these are not, I don't know if they're not, if they're non-toxic but it doesn't say on here um these are the ones that say that they are non-toxic uh fade proof waterproof and acid free so these are the ones we're going to test now and i believe you're getting different markers you're getting two sizes of the gold and the silver and one size of the black so let's just take them out and start yeah, start testing them out. Let's see here. All right, so I think this is the, oh uh, yeah, this is the, the more, the thick one. And I believe the other one is a thinner one. So you can do stuff with them together. And the same with the silver, there'll be a thick one and a thinner one so this is a thinner one so it's like a silver sort of metallic-y kind of a kind of a paint and then this is the, the thick one as you can see here and the last one is the black one or i i believe it's black let's see what let's see what colors yep this is a black sort of fine zoom out a little bit so you guys can see the sort of the, the shine of the the silver has the most shine um but i think they're all supposed to have various like a little bit of shine to them and um as i said earlier this is a this is a stamp now you have to um these are easier to use if you have a stamp block and then you put these on a stamp block and um you can use like a waterproof ink on on the on the stencil and then um take it on there and put it on there and then you can color or use water soluble medium or whatever on there and then this is the same this is not the same thing but this is a stencil and then you can use the stencil exactly like a stencil like when you were a kid and you would stencil them out and um this is a pattern a uh, good thing i the first thing i thought about this was using this with like neo color neo color twos or with um gelatos or something like that a uh, sort of a 
he- thicker end kind of a water soluble medium or not water soluble but something like a gelato or neocolor ones or neocolor twos um these would be really cute with that um and i think that that's i think that that's everything overall this is a really nice box um you know the i'm not sure what these items cost individually but the price seems you know seems within reason to me um especially for a monthly box which you know you always kind of you never really get the best deal on the monthly boxes because you have to pay for the person's work the putting it together all that all that so but um overall this is a really nice little setup here um the paper that i ended up using is paper from another monthly box i got um and uh this is a strathmore i think this is a 200 series uh watercolor notebook and um it works out okay in this so um overall this is just a fun little experiment i definitely um i definitely like this box and uh i definitely if you are into lettering at all this is definitely something that i would recommend and that i would say that you get and do over i especially like the stencil and the stamp as well as the markers um, as they sort of fit my my sort of thing a little bit more than the than the journal does but um overall this is really fun a little box to get and a great surprise so i hope you guys enjoyed this video let me know down in the comments if you have any questions i'll link to their website and give you all the information about their membership and uh, i will see you guys next time bye oh and don't forget to stay for a video of one of the cats all right i'll see you guys later bye